Okay, Aquarius, this is your weekly. I hope it resonates. Take what you need and leave the rest. Sun card. The most happiest card in the deck. What's going on for you? Aquarius. Love, 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 love. Hmm. I'm hearing Love Boat. The theme from Love Boat. Love Boat. Soon we'll be making another run. Ooh, we got the, uh, somebody's waiting, okay? Wondering if you'll ever find love, okay? Wondering if true love will ever come your way. Dreaming about what you want and love, okay? I got the, the two of cups that's peeking out also, okay? So you're thinking about love, wanting to be in another relationship, Wanting to be in a beautiful relationship. Not just any relationship. You want the creme de la creme of love. Got something very positive coming your way. Uh, this person may have a gap in their tooth. Or maybe you have a gap in your tooth. Or a missing tooth. Okay. It may be a little embarrassing. Okay. If you have a missing tooth or whatever. But we got wish fulfillment here. But we have the four of swords. Meaning it's going to be a little bit longer. And, and be open to love. And because lately you haven't really been open to relationships. But now you're ready. Okay. You've probably been holding yourself off for the right one. Of course, who hasn't? But you don't want to waste your time with just any penny and a, penny any kind of love. You want the good stuff. Good love. Okay. Probably haven't really been doing any kind of dating. Probably being a little celibate. Is that a phrase? Maybe celibate. A little whatever. Okay. Because you've hurt. You've been hurt before. Okay. Been devastated in love. And you know, this love past relationship that you were in really hurt you. Okay. But we have the Ace of Pentacles here. And and you thought that this relationship or this love relationship would really be a good thing, but it ended up hurting you. It devastated you. It rocked you rocked you to the core. Okay. And this is what you've been waiting for. You said, I'm not gonna invest my time in any more relationships. I'm waiting. I'm I just don't want to be bothered with it, with it right now. Okay. If you were to hook up with somebody, you think that it would be a bother. We got the four, we got the print the um the Empress here. You know what you want now, okay? You know what you want now. You want everything. Finally, because you found your strength. You know what you want in your life, okay? It's crazy. We've got the, the, the page of wands and the page of pentacles. Right now, you haven't really been putting a lot of thought or effort into a relationship to giving yourself completely to someone, okay? I'm hearing Michael Bolton completely. I want to give myself I want to give my love to somebody completely, to someone who completely loves me. Some for someone who completely, some for someone who completely gives their heart to only me. Okay, that's what you want to love completely. You're finding your strength, your inner strength, your inner power to say, "This is what I want," and I'm not going to accept anything less. If you know that this motherfucking emperor can't give you what the hell you want, stay out of the cookie jar. Okay. I'm not accepting less than what I damn well deserve this time around in my life. If you can't give me the love that I damn well need or the respect that I damn well am telling you or that you know that I need in my life, then back off. But I'm not going to do this because I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm the whole kitten and caboodle. I'm the ace of motherfucking cups. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm the ace of cups. If you, can't, if you can't match me, then we don't need to talk because you've turned on your womanly or your manly charm. And you're not, you're not deviating from the strength that you have received from your spiritual guidance, from your spiritual awakening. Okay. Cause you know that you done woke up and finally smelled the coffee and that coffee smelled pretty damn good. And you want to share it with your emperor. You want to share it with your king. You want to share it with your queen, your empress, whoever. Okay. You want to match wits with this person and we're going to do this or we're not going to do it at all. If we can't do this together, if we can't get through what we've been through in the past individually, and collectively in this connection, then we don't need to be together. Because we need to figure out how we can get this tower energy away before we hook up. Okay? And find our peace, love, and happiness. Okay? So we got the Empress and the Emperor for the Aquarius. 
this couple what's going on with this couple please spirit justice oh could that be justice or the peace messages please for the aquarius and love the nine of pentacles okay somebody coming your way or you're headed to somebody's di in somebody's direction may meet this person and there may maybe you uh they may be in a uniform or you may be in a uniform okay it could be it could be the ups man the the what are the, the package people that amazon prime guy whoever right now you're resting and you're really really thinking about wanting to finally be in a connection with somebody okay but it's like the universe is getting ready to hand you this person. You've been through a lot in relationships here. Okay. You got this person wanting to come in and show you magical things. Maybe you're going to show them magical things here. Okay. But you're not, you really have not really dated a lot in your, in your, in your life over the past few years or year, however long it's been for you. Okay. She got this Knight of Cups energy that's wanting to come come forward for you, Aquarius. But it's like, I'm just going to wait a little bit longer, you know. And you're thinking to yourself, well, I've been single long enough. It's time for me to really, really put my mind into uh, into allowing people to, to, to come into my comfort zone. And allowing yourself to get to meet somebody brand new, okay. It's got the King and the Queen of Wands. You all want the same thing, okay. You and this, yes, you and this person... Empress and the Emperor, you all want the same thing. We got the Ten of Cups here, and we got the King and the Queen of Wands. So we have the Emperor, the Son, the Empress, the Queen of Wands, the Ten of Cups, and the King of Wands. Y'all want the same thing, the same thing, okay? Sex is going to be on point. The, if you want, don't want to get pregnant, you might want to, you know, wrap it up because y'all going to be doing a lot of love making. OK, this is going to be a beautiful connection for whoever this reading is for. You're going to find your king. You're going to find your queen. You're going to find your emperor. You're going to find your empress. Could be same sex coupled, coupled up, whatever. But whatever it is you're looking for, your person is looking for. Uh, you're looking for the same thing. You're marrying each other. I would I would. I would say that you are finally going to meet your divine feminine, divine masculine. Almost as if I want to say, uh, I want you to meet your divine feminine, divine masculine. You're on your own with the rest. All right. Talk to you later.